Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to uh, Novigo's SAP LBN Freight Collaboration Project 44 Connection Demo for a live truck tracking scenario. I'm Bimal Subagumar, a Senior Consulting Manager based out of Chicago, uh, US. Uh, Project 44 is a visibility provider who can uh, provide uh, shipment statuses. Uh, they are connected to a large number of uh, carriers across the globe and uh, they have uh, B2B connections to with many of these carriers. Uh, so uh, Project 44 can provide various milestone events and uh, even geolocations uh, for uh, these uh, full truck load scenarios. For this demo purpose, uh, we have uh, a movement from uh, um, Mississippi plant to a customer in Alabama for a full truck load scenario. For this, uh, we start with a SAP TM freight order, which has a source location as uh, a plant or a shipping point in Mississippi and a destination as a customer in um, Alabama. Uh, whenever we uh, uh, change the status of the SAP TM freight order to ready for execution, it will generate an XML uh, transportation order generic track request uh, track process request out to SAP LBN. In SAP LBN, um, uh, it actually checks whether there is a combination of the carrier and the visibility provider, in this case uh, P44, is present in Configure Partner Connections app and credentials are maintained. So once uh, this combination and credentials are available, uh, it will push a message uh, to Project 44 system. Uh, this message is put to order for tracking. Now in, uh, in Project 44 system, uh, we have a simulation for, uh, tool for this demo uh, purpose. Uh, it is pretty difficult to showcase a live tracking scenario because tracking of a shipment happens over a period of time and it can be even days and months in case of ocean scenarios. So in order uh, to demo, uh, we, uh, Project 44 has a simulation tool available which will give uh, statuses every five seconds. Uh, these can be milestone events like uh, departure and date of arrival um, um, or arrival events. Uh, or it can be geolocations, uh, the actual uh, position of the truck on the map, longitude and latitude. And they can even provide something like estimated date of arrival, which is like a, a machine learning analytics based uh, date, uh, um, which, can be, which can be used as a realistic uh, date of arrival at the destination. So that is pretty unique to uh, these visibility providers to provide those kind of data. Now, once those uh, data are available, it will show uh, show up in our track freight movement app and uh, the maps in it in LBN tenant. And we can actually see the live location of the truck. Now, out of all these, uh, only milestone events will be propagated to SAP TM freight order and it will show up in the execution tab. And these are uh, sent through transportation, even bulk notification. Now, even estimated date of arrival uh, can be received in SAP TM freight order, but there are some limitations to it. Now, uh, once it is received in SAP TM uh, the freight order, it can be used for multiple purposes. Uh, for example, customers can be notified about the uh, realistic time of arrival in case of a delay or uh, in, in case of a customer inquiry. It can help in freight settlement, uh, especially like uh, when it actually departs. Uh, that is when we should start our settlement in many scenarios and even for revenue recognition purposes to generate billing and uh, uh, in many scenarios. So. Uh, these event status are pretty critical uh, for the downstream process of a SAP TM flight order. Now let us go to a live uh, demo. Uh, I'm just uh, opening a SAP TM freight order. As you can see, uh, this is uh, uh, based out of a sales order and it generated a freight unit. I have planned it uh, using cockpit and uh, it has, uh, uh, it created a freight order. Now, uh, 
in general data tab you can actually see it's a full truckload resource it is moving from boonville location it's a source location which is a shipping point and it is going to alabama which is where our customer is so as a first step i will just go and uh, change the status to ready for execution uh, typically this happens when the warehouse is ready and we are ready for execution and once we save it uh, a message will be generated uh, so I can show that message uh, in our uh, service utilities monitor a message is generated and it is sent to um, LBN now I will log into LBN uh, so this is a LBN screen uh, where there is something called configure partner connections uh, there are credentials maintained for a combination of this carrier and project 44 for a service of uh, shipment road tracking FTL. So based on this combination, uh, it uh, sends messages to uh, project 44 system. In this case, it is going to a simulation tool. Uh, so if I go to project uh, freight tracking and uh, if I can put this uh, freight order document we can actually see that the execution has already started so this is a freight order which we sent from sap tm to sh available in the shipper tenant of sap lbn and we see that it is a boonville shipment it is going to alabama and uh, if i scroll down there are two planned events departure and uh, arrival and uh, if you can actually see, uh, if you sc we scroll down in the map, you can actually see the mo execution has already started from Boonville. So to, it is going towards Tupelo. And uh, this is Alabama and uh, this is Mississippi. And it's a cross border state to state move. And we can actually zoom in and zoom out and see the entire uh, map too and these are here maps and uh, we, we don't need any separate license for it it's all included in sap lbn license as of now and uh, when i refresh it i can actually see the truck is actually moving uh, and it has already reached in between uh, so this is a live movement of truck again this is a simulation tool which is giving us um, fictitious data every five seconds uh, but in real life these will these feeds will be coming from gps uh, of the truck and these events will be also be posted and multiple more uh, events can be posted not only just arrival and departure unloading begin unloading and proof of delivery all these events can be posted in real life now. but simulation tool is uh, predominantly for demo purpose because demoing a live tracking scenario is pretty difficult because uh, these things happens in real time and uh, yeah so yeah, I'm just refreshing it and I can actually see it is now moving uh, towards the destination. It is taking the road, actual road move. And uh, you can actually see the departure events, many other events, planned events are available. It has departure, uh, departure event is reported and actual event date and time is available. Um, and uh, similarly, there are uh, at destination location, multiple events are available. So we are looking at arrival event to be reported by uh, P44 once it is uh, reaching the destination. Now, all these events are coming from P44 system for in demo purpose, it is coming from simulation tool. But in real life, it will be from P44 system. P44 in turn gets this from carriers and truck GPS and other visibility providers. So yes, uh, we don't have to connect individually to each of these uh, uh, carriers. Uh, P44 can provide all this uh, information. And uh, with LBN, we don't, uh, these connections to SAP TM will be very seamless, uh, like what we are seeing. So I'm just doing the final refresh and we can see that that truck has uh, very truck is very close to the plant. This is the truck that we are talking about. And if you click on it, you can actually see the current location. 
so this is what uh, we can uh, uh, achieve in production also in the latest project where uh, the customer calls and asks where the uh, shipment is uh, they can uh, the customer service representatives uh, who have who can have access to tracking app in lvn can say that it will arrive uh based on this estimated delivery arrival uh, provided by p44 saying that this is a realistic time and they can even say currently the truck is in this location and that can have a very good impression on the carrier uh, in the for our for the customers so i am just doing the final um, refresh and uh, i can see that it has actually reached now the color has changed to orange uh and you can see that i will even this reported in lbn and uh, you can actually see the uh, freight uh, the document is also updated now if i go back to my uh, uh, sap system uh, so from lbn they are pushing all these messages to lbn so i can see multiple bulk uh, uh even notification messages are received in the system so these are the milestone events that we have received uh from uh lbn now if i go back to my freight order and if i go to the execution tab and if i refresh i can see the arrival and departure event these are the events uh, and with the actual date and time these are the events reported by p44 so in real life also we can use this in reports uh, for uh, actual versus uh, uh, planned uh, reports and then we can check the carrier performance also so in this way this is uh, this is what we can Uh, reals- uh, realistically show closer to the production scenario but uh, yeah in production uh, uh, real scenario it will be much more realistic with um, uh, data uh, from uh, live data from the trucks and uh, carriers um, this concludes our demo and uh, thank you for watching